Hello friends, welcome to another episode of Postman. So today we are going to discuss on the Postman GUI interface session and we'll discuss on the three components like header, slider and the header editor sections. So let's get started. Let me open my Postman. So this is a complete GUI of Postman and we have a header section so under header section we have this buttons and this options so under options like file you can create a new or a new tab or new postman window and you can import uh, collections and also do some adjustment for settings and in the edit section you can do uh, undo and redo copy cut paste some of the useful items and in the view section you can have this toggle full view and the zoom in zoom out options and also you have a toggle slide bar and toggle to plan view and uh, we have this buttons called a new request so in the new create new section we have this request and the collections and environment and you can have this api documentation and mock servers monitors and api six and we have some templates options so we can use this templates and also some of the api networks and you can import uh, any collection or if you have any shared collection you can uh, directly import here and we have a runner and we have an option to open a new tab or postman window or runner window and you can manage uh, the workspace from here so you can select any workspace or you can create your own workspace and uh, you have this uh, sync up api button and settings buttons and all this and we'll discuss in deep uh, about these buttons and uh, options in uh, going in future sessions and uh, here we have this uh, the slider section where you can create uh, you can have this uh, history of uh, all the api requests you can store you can see here and you have a collections even whenever we create a collection that going to be display here and you can have some of the apis and uh, this is the actual editor section so where uh, you can have a new request like this and uh, can have you can provide uh, some request URLs and endpoints and you can save save here and you can see the request at the bottom and uh, at the bottom options we have uh, some of the buttons like the hide slide bar section so if you are dealing with smaller window or smaller monitor size you can hide the slider bar and you can uh, unhide this and also if you want to see the request and response side by side you can uh, click on this option plus two to plan you so it will show the request and the response editor so you can see this console options from the console option at the bottom so once you open this one you can see all the console logs and in going sessions we can go deep in all these options so thanks for watching and please do subscribe to my channel thank you